We're gonna go to some shops and there's people and it's awkward, so come with us. <laughs> Whatever it is. And nowhere had the shoes that I want. I want the Check my shoes. No, checkered vans or harachis. Black harachis. Check my shoes. No, I'm right. I just what? want another pair of checkered vans. Mine are so like old and stained. But nowhere had them. So yeah. Look at that little suit. I wouldn't really call that a suit. No, that's a one. Oh, um, <laughs> ah, it's quite quite cute. Anyway, she's starving, so gonna go to where? GRX. GRX. <laughs> <laughs> That bomb in the apartment, I because how cheap were those prices? It's like four pounds, I want to say 25 for like a double vodka or a double, um, like just a raw now. That's not like my kind of place, you know what I mean? Oh my god, dog, look how fluffy! <laughs> oh, fluffy baby, um, yeah. I might wrap my friends in for a night out at the bowling alley because <laughs> that's my kind of thing. Boutique. Um, I aunt. I'm not very good at this. I don't know what to say. Hello. Hi. See, she's not good either. Don't be stiffs. Kids, pick your main. Beef burger, nuggets, hot dog, pizza, drink. Don't shoot like water, chips or crisp, and a mini cookie for £4.40. Forget the chips, I want it. In it? <laughs> that ain't bad, that. That's like a whole meal deal plus a cookie for £4.40. Bit chilly. And you can win a seagull while you're at it. That's good, that. My sister. Joking. My brother. It is your brother. <laughs> No, I'm joking, that's not very nice. 22 flavours of ice cream. What, you're gonna fit 22 scoops in one one tub? Yeah, pile it up. <laughs> That'd be a right challenge, that. And then, I manage. We're walking past Kaylee's favourite places, plural. So, Place. if she starts violently sobbing, don't mind her. She's I don't care about the dungeon. A bit emotional, oh, she's gone off dungeons. I don't care about me. Well, guys, it's happened. The dungeon era has come to the end. That is such a good show, you know. Hi, Jinx. I get to see that for a fiver. Fridays at half past two. Guessing it's from now. What a skilled yeah. examiner. Yeah, the greatest showman's enthusiast. I'd put it as that as well. Very good. Yeah. Dungeons. <laughs> I'll to go in the dungeon. Brother, uh. <laughs> Brother, uh. Brother uh. I want to see that again. Oh. What I show. And I want to go ice skating myself. Love ice skating. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I might need to pop in at some point. Is it, is it admission? Free. Oh, free. Free showtime. Very good. Good one. TK Maxx, I want to pop in here actually, so I'll put the camera on. Beef burger a pound, double cheeseburger two, barbecue chicken 130, loaded nachos, chips, gravy is a pound, four nuggets is two pounds, and hot dogs a pound. Not bad. Copyright music, la 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 la. Um, yeah, we're literally just doing a big fat circle, big fat circle, oh, that's not a very nice smell. Big fat circle. Big fat circle. Yep. I am so tired. 
And um, I met a, um, a follower last night, well I met quite a few actually, but one of them that I met, um, I can't remember, but he told me how old he was. Can't exactly remember. Um, but he was like, I'm this old and I wake up early every morning and you always need naps. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> your point is, <laughs> like, I do need naps. I am a 19 year old in the body of a 90 year old. Uh, it's just the way it is. No, it's pretty much always been. Oh, these are hot, but I think my ma showed that the other day, so no need to show it again. Are you joking? <laughs> I wanted to get that mask from there. They had a wig and a eye mask that I wanted, and now it's for sale or to let. That's sad. Get a football. Indian. And you can get a nan witch. Tandoori baked nan with a filling of your choice and rice. Served with salad and a drink. That's pretty cool, that. <laughs> Eleven till four. A non witch. My used to be my favourite shop ever. I don't have a favourite shop. Well, for my um, I think thirteen piercings. I think it is. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, yeah, thirteen piercings. And I'm 19 and I've got 19 tattoos and I want loads more but I'm going to have to get at least one for when I turn 20 next month. Go into gardens, as you can see. Basta. I've never been to Bella Italia. Yeah, it's, what's it called? Expensive. <laughs> what does that translate into? Expensive. That's what Mookie said at the circus when someone's got a light-up toy, he'll go to the parents and say, what are those called? And then they'll go expensive. <laughs> yeah, they're £10. That is a hench seagull. £10. They're very easily in front. I know they don't, bloody hell, that's an even hench seagull. That's a fat seagull. With a poorly foot. Oh, look at the pigeon. Oh, just laid on the floor. I'll take it home. Oh, and yeah, it's just <laughs> pick it up. You're mine now. <laughs> I'll, I'll have you. You're my friend now, we're going to have soft tacos! And then that time you had an egg and you kept it under your pillow. Yeah, so we went camping when we were kids to this like little farm. It was a really nice, very small farm. I think it might have been Smithy Farm, yeah. And um, yeah, they, they had chickens there. And we were helping the farmer to collect the eggs. Because we, we ate eggs back then, it was a long time ago. And I said to the farmer, if I pay you, can I have an egg? And he charged me 20p, so I gave him 20p. And I got an egg and I kept it wrapped in this really, really big fluffy blanket to keep it warm. And I was so convinced and so set on the fact that I was gonna like look after this egg until it hatched into a chick. And I brought it home, kept it under my pillow, wrapped in the blanket with my duvet over the top when I was out of bed. And then one day my granddad stripped my bed to like wash it and make it nice and he as he stripped it because it was a bunk bed and i was on the top bunk and he threw it all onto the floor and my egg broke and i was absolutely devastated she saw her man <laughs> mr presley oh, i'm gonna go broke <laughs> gonna go broke <laughs> Quite, quite a nice dress. Let's go up there again. No, on um. Let's go up there again. I don't even remember what date, but <laughs> it's really bad that I don't remember. But when so funny girls, the cabaret bar on Dixon Road recently celebrated its 30th birthday, um, and they lit the tower pink to celebrate it, which I thought was really cool. Should have put some feathers on it. Oh yeah. Some feathers, some glitter. Yeah. That is a speedy mobility scooter. My guy's got no He's time got to waste. To be. He's got the portrait. <laughs> <laughs> no, that'll be us if we all get one. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was really cool. They threw like a full on birthday party for Funny Girls. They had a cake and everything. <laughs> yeah. And it was a pretty cool event. Oh, that dog is so cute. Oh. oh. 
lots of doggos out in the town. I love Waterstones. Love, I got a book recently actually that I've not read yet, so. I need to get around to reading it, but reading isn't my strongest suit because I have a lazy eye. Slightly. I just find reading a little bit hard. Like, I used to struggle in school with it a little bit, but I do really enjoy doing it. And I love writing, so. It's not the best. I like that guy's hat over there. <laughs> Come on, dude. You mean last? Last. <laughs> not dude. Go on, girl. <laughs> Back where we just were. Wow. <laughs> Yay, except we're going to make progress this time and not go back that way. Oh, I. they have those. The skin facial globes. They're very good. Very good for your skin. <laughs> And its purpose? You make some progress. And its purpose? I don't know. Yes, you do. Liar! <laughs> it's this street. Whatever it's called. I don't know street names, I just know how to get to places. Um, went in Coral because he needed a wee. And it wasn't that busy. What? It wasn't that busy. Kind of what? Not really. Seen it a lot busier. Um, but. Went to the shops, got some garlic bread, which we are very happy about. Garlic bread. Garlic bread. Just garlic bread. Been craving it all month. Literally for so long. I haven't had it in ages. So we've got garlic bread. Um, so that's our tea sort. <laughs> um, that's that's still a pub that I haven't been in yet. Never been in. So. I mean, it looks quite nice. It looks quite cosy. Dogs are allowed in that. Yeah, looks quite cosy, but never been in. I will at some point. Um, there's Stanley's show bar at the end. Not been in there in a hot minute either. Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, bless you. I feel like that's all these guys hear me say, but it's true. I'm really, really tired. And what day is it? Is it Monday? Yeah. Oh, I've got the hiccups. Oh, you talk. I've got the hiccups. Hi. Hi. That was good. Well done, Kaylee. Where'd you get your car from? Where'd you get your car from? <laughs> car on road. Car on road. Oh, look. Car on road. It's a car on road. Car on road. It's just up road. Big wheel, is that it? Because imagine being on big wheel and it just starts chucking it down. I've been on icon while it's chucking it down. Oh no, that's not pleasant. So, gonna take a walk down it, pop in a couple of shops on Senny, which is Central Drive, and then make our way home because. Getting late. <laughs> Loud. Do you remember when I was going to be a paramedic? I went to college and I was doing paramedic practice and I wanted to be a paramedic. Um, and then, like, literally like a week into starting the college course, they stopped doing it. And they put all of us onto a vet course, a veterinary course. And I was like, but I don't want to be a vet. I want to be a paramedic. Yeah. And the teacher we had was like, well, it's it's pretty, pretty much the same course. You'll learn the same stuff. And I was like, but I don't really think I'm going to give a rabbit CPR and it's going to be as effective as doing it on a human. Or like, I don't know, let's say like if a human's having a seizure and a rabbit has a seizure, I don't really think I'm going to treat them the same. And if, if I do, if you're telling me I do, then that's a bit wrong. Rabbits have seizures? I don't know, they might. <laughs> but the point is that a vet course will be very different to a paramedic course. So I just stopped going in the end. And <laughs> now I'm a drag queen. And sometimes when I have stressful nights at work, I say, 
Why am I here? I could have been a paramedic. But really, I couldn't because I would have been a vet instead. So, sad times. What did I want to be before that? I always wanted to dance. I can't remember what my college options were. I don't know, I can't remember. Oh. <laughs> Hello. What poor central. Um, yeah. It's been a privilege and a pleasure. <laughs> Thank you for walking with us. And good night. Good night. <laughs>